right guys, this is David Sikinimi Comics doing another comic book cover highlight for you. I got five books here for you. It's pretty much all bangers here. Hope you like it. If this is your first time to my channel, please subscribe, give a thumbs up to this video and comment below. Let me know what you think. All right, so I got five books as always. And along with that, I got, I'm gonna tell you the title, the year that it was released, the cover artist, and any significance in that issue, along with what has been sold on the secondary market in the past three months. And I'll tell you the prices from what has been sold on eBay. So eBay happens to be the largest LCS in online, not in line, online. All right, but also check out your local LCS, support them if you see them in this, check out their back bin, Dig through it maybe you might find these in the back bin if not check out the wall book because you might actually actually might get it for cheaper all right so let's start with spider-man issue number 16 released in 1991 todd mcfarlane cover this is the last mcfarlane art on spider-man before he moved to image so this is uh, I guess a minor key or small key. I don't know. To me, it's just a great art. As you can see, it says here by Todd because he knows that this is this last Spider-Man that he ever gonna draw for Marvel. All right. So what has been sold raw from? Actually, it's not a it's not an expensive book. It's, you can buy this for two to six dollars on the secondary market that was sold in the past three months. Nine eight. The last sold for seventy five dollars. All right, the next book is Spawn issue 221, released in 2012. McFarlane cover, Air 15 homage. Raw, the last one, the Raw sold for $81. The 98, the last one sold for $260. So it's a great uh, homage cover. Just love it. And um, yeah, McFarlane, one of the longest running independent comic. All right, the next book here is Tomb Raider issue number 33, released in 2003. Adam Hughes cover. This is a cover B. I think this is cover A. I think that's cover B by Tony Daniels. But anyway, Adam Hughes cover, released in 2023. Raw selling for average about 40 bucks. None of the 98 has been sold. There's a lot of 96 that has been sold for like 160, 1 something. But as for 98, there are None has been sold, but asking about 320, 300 to 320. Yeah. All right, that is that. Uh, this is one of my very favorite Adam Hughes cover. Yeah, I won't tell you why. You figure it out. Just some, something about camel toe. All right, uh, next one is Catwoman issue number 51. The very iconic cover. Adam Hughes released in 2006. Now this one has been going up and down, but the last one sold in raw for $200 and the 9.8 sold for $350. Yeah, so iconic, I don't know, must have, you figure it out, but that's just how it is. On this. All right, the last but not least in this, and the last one is Green Lantern issue number 55. This is one of the 25 ratio variant cover done by Doug Mackey. Um, released in 2010. One of the very, very sought after Lobo cover because there's not many Lobo cover out there. This happens to be my favorite. 98 sold for $695. Raw, they're asking Oh, the last raw that was sold was for three hundred dollars, and best offer was taken. So I'm assuming probably two seventy, two fifty. All right, so that is that. I'm sorry about all this thing. Gotta figure out what the hell's going on. Okay, so that is my five books for this comic book cover highlight. Hope you enjoyed it. And uh, if, like I said, if this is your first time into my channel, if you like all this uh, bloopers and thing. Yeah, check it out. All right, until next time, shoots. Longest running independent comic title. <laughs> whoa, whoa, shit.